Hi, and uh, welcome back to fleetmusic.blogspot.com. Uh, this is the third video uh, in a series where I'm looking at uh, drum uh, synthesis. And uh, now we're going to look at producing our fourth and final snare before we actually move on to producing some other uh, drum sounds. So we're going to select uh, this algorithm. Uh, turn the voices down to 1 as per usual, turn off oscillators C and D because we're not actually going to use them but we're just going to use A and B and we're going to use a bit of FM. Um, as in a previous example, um, let's just rename this actually, so uh, snare, snare 4, oops. Uh, yeah, as in the previous example, um, we're going to use fixed tunings, and so we're going to tune it to an F, uh, is that F2, I think, um, yeah, F2, um, and as previously we're going to uh, bring the sustain right down, bring the decay to around about 100, 150, Ish. Um, we're then going to um, activate or bring up the level of oscillator B and we're going to turn that to uh, fixed tuning and we're going to dial in a setting of uh, 355 which is the next F up. You can hear that kind of metallic FM quality coming through. We're going to copy the, actually the um, the envelope from oscillator A and the effects that oscillator B is having on A we're obviously modulating by changing the level uh, and actually we're going to um, use oscillator C and select the noise uh, looped waveform uh, to give us that noise component and we're going to turn this to fixed I'm just going to do this by ear, really. Wherever you think. Uh, we're now going to engage our high pass filter. We're going to go for a high pass 12 dB filter, and we're going to have the cutoff around about uh, 198. Uh, I'm going to go back here actually and do something, sort out the envelope or the noise, make it a bit tighter. Just the decay to suit, really. The next step is um, to engage the pitch envelope, uh, bring up the level to let's say around 30 odd, and let's now um, take a listen to that. Sounds pretty woody. Um, let's bring in the decay to make it really short and snappy, just so we're going to use the envelope or the pitch envelope to give us that initial kind of attack, transient, kind of snap feel. Bring up the peak just to bring out that, and maybe see what you think about this level for the sustain. Let's leave where it is. I'll just take a moment just to um, check out the kind of effect that increasing or decreasing the decay amount has on the overall pitch. Sounds a bit tighter to me. But yeah, that's our final snare. And as a kind of reminder almost, we can remember it might be useful to um, use some of our effects. So here's our New York style parallel compression. Uh, send a bit of that of our signal to the plate just to bring out the tail a bit. And yeah, we're done on our snares. Uh, I'm going to end this video here uh, and actually um, start afresh and we're going to be looking in the next video at uh, some hi-hats. Okay, see you in the next